How much did you enjoy getting up there and getting a chance to talk to kids? I think it's fun. Anytime you can, uh, you know, go around the community if it's hospital visits, school visits. I think it's 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 fun to see uh, the smile of the kids and uh, just talk with them, and and that's about it. Do you think, as a professional athlete, you really have the opportunity to make an impact on their lives? Well, I don't know. Again, you know, there's 300 kids. If you can, um, you know, get to 50 of them, I think it's it's it's, it's good. But again, the, the kids make their own choice. I think we, we just uh, share our experience. And at the end of the day, I do think we, we make a difference. So on how many of them, we'll never know, I guess. Did you ever have something like this when you were growing up, where someone came and spoke to you about the importance of education and nutrition and bullying? We did, but but not with uh, professional athletes. I mean, we had you know teachers, principals, and stuff. I think um, each year it's, it's getting more involved, and the topic is getting bigger, which is good. I think uh, it's important for us, you know, to to come here and then let them know that you know that's not okay. That we need to be helping each other and, and be good people. And they really asked you some good questions when they, when they got opportunity, right? Yeah, I think again, I think you know they're smart kids, and then the teachers are doing a great job. And, it was fun. I think my parents were very influential, obviously, with me. I think uh, they were always very good with my brother and I about helping each other out and, um, you know, just, just being good good kids. And So I think, uh, you know, it, it starts at home and I think at school the teachers can also make a big difference.